could hear his voice real clearly. And none of them were things I came up with, even painting with my fingertips with his doing. And he would say, OK, get out yellow, <laughs> get out red. had the trillium which is coming to earth. It's just overshadowing all that, that happened on this planet to bring this new hope, this new um, life to us. And so I made it just as transparent as I could that he actually just stripped himself of his royalty and his glory and um, offered himself. The, the joy of heaven sort of broke forth, but it was quiet. You know, there weren't, weren't very many people who heard about it. And in just the, the little hay that he was on and the, the purple for the royalty that he actually was and the, the stripes for, for what he was willing to go through that he did come to die. I wanted it to look like that worship that would take place in your inner heart. Certainly all of heaven was worshiping. And that little by little, I guess he showed us what, what that is. This was the hardest of all of them. He knew the crown of thorns would be there. It already has the shroud. I realized that in that garden, he was willing to not have any friends. They all fell asleep. They betrayed him, they left him. He totally was relying only on the Father. And then he said, okay, and they went out and then the trial started. This painting was totally different than the others. Um, I, I painted it mostly with my fingertips. I was trying to see if his own fingertips doing this. It wasn't a, an idea that he sent us. It was the living God. He wanted us to see what it cost him. There were three men, you know, that hung there. The leaf is the God's view of what was happening on earth. And in his view, it's already clear that this man had chosen death. This man has already come into life, going toward the sun. And he, he, the Lord Jesus said, and today you'll be with me in paradise. I wanted the, the sense that he broke every barrier. He calls us out of the darkness, that there's, there's a tomb and it's dark in there, but he can roll the stone away and we can come out in the swoosh of life and power. And he's saying, go and just be life to the world. Let me explode the barriers that have held you down. Every law of the universe that would have tried to control what happened was broken that day. Five hundred people at least saw him after he died and they watched him go up into heaven and I wanted just a sense of his majesty and his awe the glory and it's also the reverse of the first painting where he had joined back completely with the father. The two leaves coming out to the side are forever all time it would be glorified that he had been on a cross and just the royalty for the robes and the red for what he did and just the glory of heaven just he, he went back to the father. it to look like the world from space. I wanted it to be that Jesus came to make us a new creature in Him. And it was the sense of that, that all this came from the Father and the Son. This would be like the light of heaven. That would be like Jesus being the rock and the blood of the covenant, the living water. It's like the child of faith just reaching and taking hold of that first little rock to begin to understand that. And the Holy Spirit just pouring out his beauty and splashing it all over the place. For me, 